All righty, ladies and gentlemen, was reading some of that wrestling news. The numbers came out for Dynamite. 975,000 viewers. Not a terrible uh, number for a B company, but like for a free pay-per-view, a TNA-style free pay-per-view, you can't even break a million. I mean, you know a company is going to succeed when they copy the business formula of TNA, folks. Hey, Drew McIntyre, welcome back to the show, I mean. Now, Drew, you're a part of the A show, SmackDown, which has more viewers, if I'm correct. Ha <laughs> ha, that's right, Wrestling Jesus. Not only do we have more viewers, we have twice as many viewers as those bitches. Ha ha ha, Drew. Twice as much. Twice as much. And McMahon doesn't even try. That's the sad part, folks. AEW, I think they try. I don't know what the fuck they're doing, folks. But things are going to change. This was the last show of the year. You know what I mean? They had Kyle O'Reilly there. At the end of the show, because you got to retain viewers for the new network. You know, should we bring the champ on the show? Maybe have Punk do more than the two-minute throwaway promo. Should we bring uh, maybe Daniel Bryan on the show? Since he's challenging for the match next week. You know, new network for the title. No. Nah. Let's uh, have Kyle O'Reilly, who looks like a big retard. In the ring there. That's that's gonna get viewers, folks. But once Windham shows up, ladies and gentlemen, Windham. Once they go to TBS, folks, this this is an upgrade. I mean, an upgrade, downgrade. We got NHL now. Let's get rid of this wrestling show. This is an upgrade. I mean, it's available in more homes. Nobody watch it, but it's an upgrade. Once Windham shows up, things are going to turn around. When Barry Windham comes back to TBS, boy, they're going to go straight up to 2 million. This is successful. Successful company. Till next time. Peace. Ah.